Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. I'm David Carroll, your Las Vegas realtor with Signature Real Estate Group, and welcome to Quail Cove by KB Homes. Have a look around. We're located out here in Summerlin, Las Vegas, in West Summerlin. Another beautiful day. Five mile an hour winds were 3,398 feet above sea level, and look at those strip views. Now this is a new product by KB Home. They're three-story homes. They have four models to choose from out here. Prices starting in that high 600s to the low 500s to start. Coming around here on the end, this is the 1651 model, priced at $469,900. It's a three-story, two to three bedroom, two and a half to three and a half baths with a two bay garage. And then right next door, we have the 1920 plan. It's a three-story, three to four bedroom. Two and a half to three and a half baths. This one starts at four eighty nine nine. Then you have the twenty two twenty six, starting at five hundred twenty four nine ninety. Three to four bedrooms, two and a half to three and a half baths, and that two bay garage. And on the end, the twenty three zero two, their largest, starting at five hundred thirty four thousand. Now, how it works out here is there's really no rear yard. You have the rear driveway. You either have the five foot driveway or the full length 19 foot driveway. And today we're gonna to be featuring the 1651 model, two to three bedroom, two and a half to three and a half bath. Elevation A starts at $469,900. And I'm ready to see what they put inside. Let's go take a closer look. All right, coming along the walkway by the models. I'm, I'm super stoked to take a look at these brand new products. And they are gorgeous. You also got Black Tail by Pulte Homes across the street, some more three stories. As we come up, some of the structurals you can do on this model, you can do the enclosed porch with the gate. You also have a few different elevation choices. You got double doors at the bonus room. You got storage at the bonus room. You do a den with a powder at the bonus room. Storage with a den with a powder. Door storage, bedroom three at the bonus room. There's a lot of structural options. You can do some tub and shower options as well. Looks like all spray on stucco. Just want to take a quick peek here on the side. So very uh, low maintenance on these homes. Just have a little bit of a desert landscape front yard and then the driveway in the rear. Beautiful modern eight foot. Let's head inside. Front door open. Here is our entryway. This is the downstairs where the bonus room would be. Since they did do the option, we have the bathroom or else it would be a coat closet. Nine foot ceilings, got the chandelier lighting. And look what they put in here. All this is custom. Pretty good sized room. Luxury tiles, almost four inch base. Orange peel texture and you got the corner edges. I highly advise the corner edges. Sometimes when you do the bullnose or the rolled corner edges, the paint doesn't look as perfect, in my opinion. Pedestal sink. Co closet. Garage door. And our garage. Looks like we do have a service door installed here. Tankless hot water heater by Ream, the Rainbird, the RO Loop, the water shutoffs, fire sprinklers, and some batteries charging. I do like this little storage area. So we do have some alarm controls here. Nice upgrade, mission railing. carpeting let's head upstairs all right we're gonna go ahead and head up to the third floor now taking some photos doing some Instagram lives down there but you're gonna want to see that second floor so stay tuned so we're all the way up on the third I don't feel so young anymore more open railing so on this floor it looks like we have two bedrooms so this would be bedroom number two, the two bedrooms. Nine foot ceiling, six, eight feet on the door height. 
I like what they did here on the secondary. They put the knee space. It's a small, cute knee space. No drawer on it, but it looks good. Got the ice quartz top, rectangle undermounts, dark hardware. This looks just like they're included, except black. And I love it. Tub and shower combo, all black hardware package. And welcome to Summerlin. Five mile an hour winds out there, 3,430 feet above sea level. So if you like that altitude, this is the spot. Two LEDs and two lights above. They have added the uh, pre-wire with fan and light. No extra cans. And our closet. Look at that design, wild at heart. I like it. So that's the secondary, then right across we have the primary. She's got stereo speakers because she's a model. More of that wood trim, just like on the first floor. So that first floor is just like a bonus room entry area. It's pretty sweet though. Walk-in closet on bed too. This one also has the window and the smart panel box. It's gonna be for your router, your modem. They'll install a modem and router at close. Welcome to Summerlin West. This is the Kestrel side of Summerlin West. You got the Red Point Villages right on the other side. So with KB, you usually have like three different options for the shower. This is the luxury shower with the bench. She looks beautiful. Quartz top, black trim. Got more quartz on the edge, rectangle undermounts. And a great design. Delete or not to delete? That is the question on the medicine cabinets. And you got the water closet all upgraded, tile flooring through here. Storage for days, I love it. Wow. Got the 215 wrapping right around here. So a little bit about Quail Cove. They got the new three stories here in Summerlin. There's a total of 144 home sites. Build time from dirt's about six months. Currently, they don't have a, any release right now, but they're gonna have another release here real soon. They sold three of their five quick, quick move inspects that are coming right here. Lot premiums range anywhere from about 2,000 to 35,000. Now, the way they set these up with the driveways, you'll either have the shorty driveway that's about five foot, or you'll have the 19 foot full length driveway. No backyard. HOA is a total of $155 a month. 60 going to Summerlin West, 95 for Quail Cove. All right, so that's the primary suite. Two bedrooms on the top floor and your wash. Because it would be hard to go up and down. Got the floor pan, the dryer box. You're hot and cold. We are cooking with gas, lots of electrical. And I like that. Nice touch. Waterfall edge upgraded on the island. Upgraded cabinetry. All Whirlpool products. Do get the range included for burner and the microwave i believe is optional she's venting out and where are those cookies we we got company in here Right behind, we got some road work here. Here's our half bath. Upgraded pedestal sink. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I apologize, we have some people doing photo video here and then we have a coat closet. Thanks guys.
Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, and just like that, we're back down to the first floor. This is the 1651 plan, 1651 square feet. So what do you guys think? Quail Cove, newest home by KB out here in Summerlin. If you'd like any more information, give me a call anytime. And if you like the video, hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.